You know what's weird? These trees, these trees are weird with no leaves on the limbs. It just looks like big arms with fist just blasting up into the air. But you know what else is cool? Eating. And what better place to eat than the Hollywood Brown Derby here at Hollywood Studios in Disney's Hollywood Studios Park. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Anyways, never eaten here, but it's time to change that today. Let's get fancy. Thank you. Well, that's fun. It's like they know everyone's ordering that. I mean, hey, also, I think you were the first ticket of the day, so you're in luck. Hey. Here's what we got. Derby, pomegranate, and blood orange. So I'm assuming this is blood orange, pomegranate, and derby. This is the pomegranate one. It's good. Nothing. But they're good because they're margaritas. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's a fancy bread. Wow. Oh, it's hot. Ow. Yikes. Pretty hot bread to let that cool down a little bit. But look at the butter. The butter looks pretty fancy here. How good is it? It's real good. Here we go, got the classic old fashioned brown derby style. Looks pretty good. Couple of cherries, orange, and whiskey. Looks really good. They are getting this fancy glowing drink. It's very blue. What did you get? It's called the Malibu Beach. Oh, the Malibu Beach. Sounds very Californian. We'll be there shortly. We might even put a link to one of those videos right up here, maybe. Right up over here. It's really good. It tastes like blue raspberry. Oh, wow. Blue raspberry. Who would have thought? But that would taste like blue raspberry. So we got some charcuterie plate. We got duck, uh, some uh, some cheese. That's a drunken cheese. There's mustard. There's some of that that type of cheese. There's some of this crust. There's some fig spread, salami, prosciutto, prosciutto. No, prosciutto. <laughs> this is a charcuterie. It's a prosciutto on a charcuterie plate. So anywho. Uh, anyways, this looks pretty fancy, all the things. She says that this mustard is basically real mustard, and like your yellow mustard is like fake mustard, which I half agree, because I do like the regular like yellow mustard, but I also really like this like stone ground mustard, like this stuff. What do you guys think? Let us know in the description below, in the comments, not the description. You don't really have access to change the description, but on the comments, you can put whatever you want in there. But let us know, what do you think about this mustard versus the, the yellow mustard? For me, I would say the yellow mustard is for like hot dogs, corn dogs, hamburgers, things like that. And this mustard is for like fancy stuff, right? So fancy stuff, meaning like charcuterie boards like this, or like, I don't know. Bratwurst. Bratwurst, yeah, yeah, bratwurst. I worked in bratwurst, like fancy meats. And cheeses and stuff. Oh, JR got the, sh the chicken, chicken and dumplings. dumplings. That looks really good. When they came and brought it to the table, they actually poured some stuff on there. So I guess they poured some extra sauce on there. So that's pretty neat. We got this shrimp. Um, is that hot? Oh, yep, that's hot. So shrimp mac and cheese in there. That's real neat. And then we got that famous Cobb salad.
Okay, this looks good. This looks very refreshing. Oh, it smells delicious. Yeah, it looks very, it looks very good. It's juicy. Yeah. Yeah, it looks juicy. That's a dumpling, I think. If you get chicken and dumplings here, this is what it looks like. It's not like the soup type of thing that I would think that it normally is, or not normally, but what I'm used to. But this is what you're looking at. This is what you're getting when you come to the Brown Derby as far as chicken and dumplings. It does look so good. All right, so we gotta do this cheese pool before it cools off. Let's see if we get it. Oh no. Oh no. There's no cheese pool. Oh no cheese pool. There's no cheese pool. It still looks good. Yeah, it's just not cheesy. It's just not cheesy. So let's see how this salad is. <laughs> Take a nice big bite. That's what everybody likes to see, right? Somebody stuffing food into the goat. Why is that so good? It's really good. And we didn't get any meat in here. We didn't get shrimp or chicken. We just got the salad. Let's see what this is all about. Get a big bite. It's a pretty big bite. Oh yeah. The shrimp. Shrimp. Wow. Okay, that's good. That's a good mac and cheese. Oh, that is lots of flavor in here. And it's got like the, uh, the breadcrumbs on the top, just like mom makes. Mm. Like that big mac and cheese. One more bite. Yeah. It's actually not too sweet. And you don't wash it down real good. Or at least you're old fashioned. Thank you. Woo. This looks like a good place to sit. Oh. So yeah, that was pretty good. What did you enjoy the most? For you? That chicken. The chicken. Okay, so that's what you have. It's the chicken and dumplings. Which was, it looks pretty good. Very different than chicken and dumplings that I normally see. JR seemed to like it. He looks very excited. But we all probably look ready for a nap after that meal, which, yeah. Brown derby, brownish, right there. Come here, eat, enjoy. Yeah, See you in the next one. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Till then. See ya.